Okay, hi everyone. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to configure gateway redundancy GLBP on the Cisco router. Okay, before I'm, just, I'm going to show you how to configure, um, I want to explain you what is the GLBP. Okay, GLBP, GLBP is mean gateway local LAN. Okay. okay, we use a GBP, GLBP for uh, configure redundancy gateway and one router for the L2 uh, and one more router for the standby. Okay, GLBP is the part of the XHOP. Okay, GLBP is a part of FHOP. Okay, if we talk about FHOP, FHOP has three component. Three component. Okay, okay, one. Okay, HHOP. Okay, two, VRP. Okay, three, GLBP. GLBP. Okay, for the HSRP is is a Cisco proprietary, and VRP is a open uh, device protocol, and GLBP is a proprietary. Uh, Cisco proprietary protocol. Okay, Cisco proprietary protocol. Proprietary. Okay, it will be the same. Okay, for the SOP. Protocol. Okay, this is the FAOP component. Okay, and then we go to configure all together. You will clearly more. Okay, this is the lab that we have to configure get the redundancy using the GLBP. Okay, in this diagram, I have two router. Okay, one router and one more two router. Okay, so I have uh, one PC for the window client and connect to the switch. Okay, this is a cloud for configure internet access set to the internet. Okay, and then I'm set the title in the GNS3 okay. configure GLP redundancy GLP yeah. okay okay um, before I'm configure I'm set this router for the AVG AVG router okay okay and then this router for AVF AVF is mean Active Visual Okay, forward the Okay Okay, and for the AVG Active Visual Get the okay, or the master router.
Okay, and then for the app is in the router. Okay, and then we go to configure all together. For the step one, I'm already to sign. Step one, sign IP. Okay, for the step one, I'm already to assign a key on the uh, router of one and a router of two. I think all you know about the assign a key already, but in this video, I'm no need to assign a key again. I'm just to follow on the step. Okay, for the step one, already to assign. And then, okay, and then we go to the step two. Configure the RRP. Sorry, we are P. Configure GLVP. GLVP. Okay. Okay, we go to configure on the router of one. Okay, and go to the interface business rows of one. Okay, and then um set GLVP. Okay, for the group. Okay, and then you send the, you can set the group number between zero, one, zero, two, three. Okay, for me, for me, I'm set one. Okay, IP. Okay, I'm set. This is the visual IP for the gateway. Okay. Okay, and then I'm um, set the uh, GLBP one primary. Okay, I'm set the. Uh, for the primary, uh, the number of the primary high is mean the master and lower is mean the backup. Okay, I'm set uh, 150. Okay, okay, and then GLBP one prim. Okay. Okay, this is the. Uh, Priority Priority okay, 150 For the master router okay, This one Priority okay, 150 for the backup router Okay, I'm set already for the GLP on the router or one, and then we go to the router or two configure GLP the same. Okay, I'm go to this interface. Okay, and then on GLP one IP, you put the IP which will be Okay, and then. GLVP one priority. Okay, this is a priority for the bell adapter. Okay, and then GLVP one two. Yes, already. Okay, and then I'm try to ping from the OSP to the internet or testing the set wi Okay, open the browser. Okay, time to go. Okay, and then I'm okay, and I set to internet. Okay. And then I'm tying the website Facebook example. Okay, and then we can access to the website already. Okay. Okay, and then I'm trying to ping testing for free to the gateway for 
to the lead and go go okay okay and then untreasure okay, treasure for you want to know the gateway from the router or one or router or two okay i'm get treasure to the in a server okay that you see when you trace the okay the traffic across the traffic from the window sp goes through the east gateway that you see ne? okay okay it means this is a master router so the traffic goes through from the window sp to the this gateway for the master router and goes through to the internet okay this is the process that we configure here with bp okay and then um you can uh, go to the router one and check the glbp okay so glbp okay you can do glbp brief Okay, and then you, you can see, okay, this is the uh, priority that we set, okay, 120, and stand for the active router, this is the visual gateway that we configure, okay, this, this is the standby router that you see, okay, this is the uh, router for the standby, okay, so in the GLBP brief that, that you see, okay, this is the uh, Active router for the uh, uh, MAC address. This is a listener when the this router down. Okay, this router back up, take over to the uh, master uh, router. Okay, this is the benefit that we configure GLP for the gateway and NC. Okay, and then I'm try to disconnect from the cable from the master router that you see. Okay, I'm go to the. Okay, I'm. Okay. Okay, and then I'm go to the this board this this uh, cable. And then shut down to get you to see. Okay, refresh time on. Okay, and then reply from. Okay, when uh, this uh, router disconnect, users still access to internet. Okay, because we have the get very MSC. Okay, and then uh, this router change that okay, you can see. So GLBP brief okay that you see okay and then you can go to the backup router you wait to see okay and check the backup router and so GLBP okay brief okay that you see this primary to the active Okay, this is the visual IP. Okay, standby router down now because the master router down. Okay, and then I'm um, go to the cable, the cable, and now shut. Okay, now shut. Okay, that you see. Okay, from the change that from the Backup router to the active router or master router. Okay, and then this one change that to uh, listener. 
okay so glvp break okay then you see it will router okay okay it will router this router okay this it will router okay this is that for a router through for the standby okay this is a visual ip or visual battery and this is an ip for the it router okay and then you can show the ip glvp Okay. okay, this is a number for the router standby. Okay, this number, this is standby, this is active. Okay, this is the benefit that we configure GLVP when the, the this router down. Okay, this router take over to the active router. Okay, when the active router up, okay, this is the backup back to the standby standby router okay okay so users still access the internet uh, okay however this router down users still access the internet to this router okay because router this router for the backup router okay this is the uh, master router okay this is the ben benefit we configure glbp okay Okay, in this, in this video, I'm finished. Okay, please help me to like, comment, and subscribe on my video. Okay, thank you for watching.